Good morning, my friends. This is Destiny South here with South Mind Wellness again. Just wanted to bring you another little mindful moment, a little sanity in this otherwise completely insane world. So if you joined me yesterday, I want to thank you again for checking in today and also for taking personal responsibility for the energy that you are bringing into the world. I know there's a lot of chaos and craziness out there and it's really easy to point the finger and blame the outside circumstances for the chaos going on upstairs in our own mind. But at the end of the day, the only thing we can control, not that it's easy, is how we think, how we perceive the world and what energy and life we bring as we go into our everyday life. So if you haven't already, please find a nice quiet spot where you won't be disturbed for just a few moments and we'll keep it short and sweet. You don't need a special chair or music or anything like that. You just got to find a space where you can settle in. Get comfortable, sit, lie down, Whatever works best for you works for me. And then once you've found your comfort, go ahead and close your eyes and let's journey inward. So perhaps you can begin by just bringing your focus to your breath, just following it like the waves of the ocean in and out in and out. No need to control it at this point. Just follow it. If it helps you, try placing your hands on your chest or your stomach and you'll notice that the motion can lull you a little bit into that comfort and focus on your breath as you breathe in and out. Perhaps at this time we can go ahead and try to expand our breath a little bit. As you breathe in, take a nice deep breath, let it fill your lungs completely and perhaps hold it just for a moment before you let it go. Notice how much more relaxed your body became. Now let's just let our breath take its natural rhythm. Just keep following it. Appreciate how you don't have to work for it. You don't have to make yourself breathe. You don't have to think about it. You just let it happen. You just sit back, allow nature to take its course. And as a result, you are given life. Perhaps now would be a great time to be grateful for that breath. And while we're here in this moment of gratitude, what else can you be grateful for? I know, I know it's crazy out there. There's a lot of chaos, but that's what makes it even more important to spend some time thinking about what you can be grateful for because there is always something. Yes, there is always something wrong. There is always something ugly. But there is also a reverse to that coin and it comes down to you and your choice of that perspective. 
So if you had to choose right now, in this moment, what could you be grateful for? Who could you be grateful for? Do you have a roof over your head? You know, there are some who don't. Did you get up and put both feet on the ground and have the chance to walk around on your wonderful legs? Guess what? Some people don't. There are so many things that we take for granted. And sometimes just bringing our attention to it is enough to wake us up a little bit. And that's what we need right now. We cannot go to sleep. We must wake up. We must take responsibility for the space in between our ears and how we present ourselves to the world outside no matter how crazy it is. And when we do, things can begin to shift, but we have to do it together. Before we go, let's check in with our body a little bit. Just scan from your body head to toe. No particular speed, not lingering anywhere in particular. You just noticing how your head feels, how your neck feels, how your shoulders feel. Perhaps there's tightness. Take a deep breath and watch it release. How do your arms feel? How does your chest feel? How does your back feel? Perhaps you feel tightness. Take a deep breath and watch it release. Continuing down your legs, your knees, all the way down to your toes. And again, if you feel tension, just take a deep breath. And watch the power and how it dissolves. Look, I know it's crazy out there. So thank you. Thank you for being here. Thank you for trying to cultivate happiness and love, compassion, and sanity. That's what we need right now. I hope you'll join me tomorrow for a little moment of mindfulness. And I hope that you carry this feeling, this calm, with you throughout the rest of your day. I'm sending you and your family love, and I hope you stay healthy and happy and be kind to the world. It's what we need. <laughs>